Welcome back for more reptiles, archery, engineering. Ladies and gents, have fun and please enjoy. Okay. Hey, ladies and gents, this is Stoppy here. It's 6.37 in the morning. And right now, go to all my boys. Shady's still shedding. Let me check on him anyway. He's been shedding very good because I gave him a bath. Yeah, it's only 6.38 right now, so about a couple of seconds ago it was 6 feet, so it's a, yeah. Hey, big boy. Yeah, he's still shedding. Poor boy. Hey. It's okay, big boy. It's okay. It's okay. Good boy. And my youngest boy, he's going to turn three years old next month, and that's good. Hey, baby boy. I love you. <laughs> I love both of my boys. Always been the smartest ones. So, today is archery. Yeah, it's going to be a good day today anyway, I can feel it. And it's going to be another beautiful sunny day. And that is very good, look at this. Nice and blue skies. Absolutely freaking gorgeous. That is cool. So right now I gotta check my spare battery if it's charged. And it's still green, so that's good. Leave it there. Um, I just had my breakfast about 20 minutes ago, so that's done. Plus, I shaved last night with the um, the new shaving cream, um, shaving balm and everything else, even the beard wash, it actually made my beard smell good at night time and it, it will, yeah, it smelled good all night, so, yeah, so right now, I'm about to just get myself ready for 7.30, I gotta go there at 7.30, not too early. Well, if I go early, about 7 o'clock, I'll meet my friend Ian there to learn about longbow lessons still. He's teaching me still, so, yeah. So right now, um, yeah. So right now I need to get one hour out of the Turkey for arrows because I lost the one in the bush. Or just use the five. Yeah, I might use the five still. Don't want to lose any more. Those arrows that cost me an arm and a leg to get those. So yeah. <clears throat> so right now, I'll see you guys at archery till then. Um, I gotta wait till the sun comes up. Uh, sun comes up about seven o'clock so we can head off so I'll see you guys over there all right ladies and gents I'm here and my friend Jeff and Ian's here Ian's got to teach me how to do the longbow so right now I'm not going to bring my compound bow out of the car yet because Isaac's not here I gotta learn how to do longbow first then after I finish my longbow, I bring my um my recurve back to the car, get my compound, then that's that. So right now, I'll see you guys um probably after Isaac gets here, so I'll see you guys then. Okay, longbow action with the recurve so I can show you guys how I do. So 
so right now I'm just moving the camera away you can see me shoot so let's do a practice before Isaac gets here To the left. Okay. Now to retrieve the arrows. <sighs> okay. Okay, that's called a longbow machine. You don't look at down the arrow, you just look at the target. And that's how longbow shooting is good. You don't look down the arrow, you look at the uh, object while you're shooting. So let me do one more shot, then let's wait for Isaac to get here. And then let's do some co compound shooting. So that's got to be the thing what I need to do. Let's do a compound. Really close to the balloon, Ian. I'm uh, nearly done the really close to the t number 10. Oh, I'm sorry, but my, I, my hearing is really bad. What were you saying? No, you hit the balloon with the turkey feather. Did you? I nearly hit. Getting confidence. Yeah. N not look down the arrow, but look at the object what you're doing. Hooray! <laughs> and it'll take a while. It takes a lifetime to perfect it. Now yeah. when you get it all perfected, yeah. you start all over again. Mm. 
This week you're on, next week you'll be a beginner again. <laughs> and that's what the challenge is yep. with traditional. That's why a, a, a miss, a good miss, like you missed a balloon, is better than hitting a balloon. Yeah. Because you know you went close. <laughs> you still get pleasure out of it. With a compound, I've seen a bloke at 90 metres shoot with this bloke in Sydney. 90 metres. Oh, bastard! Oh, fuck! Oh, goodness, pulled away. <laughs> What's wrong? What's wrong, Warren? Oh, I got a nine <laughs> at 90 metres <laughs> instead of a ten. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Big difference. You only shoot it because you want to, mate. Oh, beautiful line, beautiful. Just dropped under. Use that back muscle a bit more. Yeah, you got on the target, that's the main thing. Oh, lovely, mate, lovely. Yes, yes, yes. That was all five. Yes. <laughs> now, I bought you a, a ginger beer. Old Stoney, hey, yeah, I drink that. That's very good. Well, seeing you won't bloody drink tea and seeing you be shooting, partner. <laughs> yeah. Putting up with walking and putting up with me, you've got to have something. I got a, a club in in Tully in Queensland, which is past ten. Glue on a new one or something like that. Well, I'm going to put the uh, the drop away. Oh, yeah. I, I really like the drop away. Yep. It's a nice bow, that. The timber. The timber. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's nice. Oh. It's, it's, it's really not. I'd like to, aren't they? Yeah. But that's a 45 pounder. Oh, yeah. It's laminate, but like that big is. That's nice. Ash or something. Oh, that is. I'm dead behind that. This is one of the nicest things I've ever tasted. It really smells. Well, you don't think mine's nice, well, Jim? 45's good. Because <laughs> the other one, the one I was using was, I think it was 26 pounds. Very good. Yeah. You go under the options? Um, I didn't even know it was on here. You gonna go and have a look? I'll go out and have a look. I'm gonna go back out there. I'm gonna. Uh, because I want to, they've got some eight sovereigns out there. Oh, I'm a little bit interested. Gold, gold sovereigns? No, they're, they're only eight. Oh, all right. Eight, eight of a sovereign? Yep. So they're only really. How many? Was that a shilling back in the day or something? Or? Well, I, I, I would say probably around about. Sixpence or something. Yeah. Well, it's, a, it's, it's an 8 to 2 pound, so, oh, so, a, quarter, so pound. A, quarter, sort of a quarter of a pound. Yeah, so 25 cents. Yeah, right. That's what it was. Which was, used to be 25 shillings, was it? Uh, shillings? 26 26 pence. Oh, well. well, so what material are they made out of this? They're actually made out of gold, but yep. they're, they're only uh, one gram in weight. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, you know, like they're not... It's just unusual, it's just unusual. Well a gram of gold at the moment is going for about $86 a gram. That's what it is. It's gone up a bit. $86 a gram. Mm. 
Yeah, right. Hey, Kelly. 150. Yeah. Then yeah. Because the, then you're paying beyond the actual weight of the goal anyway, so. Well, I think only about 150 is probably. That's nearly commercial value. Yeah. Yep, yeah, unless you hold it for 20 years and sell it after that, but. Yeah. You know, a lot of people are doing the, the same. And there's no guarantee. You see, yeah. at the moment, gold's reasonably. Good, it's bringing about twenty-four hundred dollars. Yeah. It's good. No, no. Twenty-four hundred dollars a troy ounce. No, no, gold's um three thousand and eighty at the moment. I've, I've bought some. You paid a very high price. Huh? That's the that's the spot price. You How can, much did you I'll pay? I'll show you. Um, you can go on ABC bullion. Yeah. I I buy through them. Yeah. Uh, for $3,083 for gold, and $34.53 for silver, a, a kilo for silver, ounce, sorry, yeah. Yeah, that's uh, retail price, that is, that's, that's honestly retail, because it's only uh, for a troy ounce, which is roughly around about 9.25 grams, they're bringing, uh, I mean, an ounce is 28 grams. An, an ounce of gold is 28 grams. An ounce? Yeah. 28 grams. And there's, must and be there's 35 two. ounces in a kilo. Yeah. Eh? And it's 35 ounces in a kilo. Yeah, I'll have a look. But yeah, I thought that was the bloody retail price. Because when I have a look at my portfolio, it shows me what it's worth, and that's the price, reflects the price. Showed you then. Yeah, that, so. that, that, that's the that's the US um, in, in US coins, uh, in US dollars. As I'm saying, it's 24, 24 oh, US. Oh, you talk about US dollars. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yeah. Shit. See, <laughs> yeah, see, right. see, 2,400 in US dollars. Yeah, right. That's yeah. Probably. That's top of the line. Yeah. Because it's only actually 2,000. 40, I think, on the on the on the ASX at the moment. 2040 US. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. And then obviously yeah, our got currencies. Put, you, you're going to yeah, put, yeah. put the yeah, yeah. Australian value back. On. You got me excited. I was like, "Fuck, has it fallen? I need to buy some more." <laughs> no, 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 no. You see, that, that, and a lot of people just don't understand that. But I always work in the US because I I convert pretty bloody quickly too and I always work it on this really on the on the value of say around about it's not about two thirds. You just add a third price on. You know, so one and a yeah, half. Yeah that's right, times, exactly. Yeah. Because it's sixty something. Sixty six cents, cents or something yeah. like that. So roughly a third. Yeah. So yeah. I work on the on the on the third basis. Yeah. I just add a third onto whatever our prices, and that way I've got the Australian dollar. Yep. Jim, I'm going to finish with this in a minute, and I'll drive 
Oh, right out. I'm just working out the different. I haven't got any distances. Oh, that's good. I'm shooting bare bow, but I haven't got any distances, so. I paid some money this time, Nick. <laughs> yeah, it was a bit overdue. I haven't shot targets for what? Have you yeah. seen me shooting targets for the last six, eight months, ten months, twelve months? Hey Isaac. No. Give me a hand up. Them right here. Is that 40? That's 40. Yeah. And guess how much poundage is my bow now? <laughs> because I changed the front string. How much is it? 54.8. 54? 54.8 <laughs> pounds. So did you kick some daylight? Yeah, I tried moving it, but no, no use. Really? Try to move it. It's yeah. Try, try and move it. It's not arrows. You're going to load the shop at the moment. Mm. Yeah. Oh, you've been waxing. I can't feel it. Mm. Good. Get my wax. I can do it last week. Yeah. Gotta get my arrows. I don't really good shot. I've got a slightly smaller stabiliser mate, the same design, mm. a bit lighter. Yeah. Nice day for it. Yeah, yeah pretty nice day anyway. I like coming here when it's like this. It's not I don't want to drink ginger beer at, at all now. <laughs> I love ginger beer. Yeah, even the Burundi one, it's one of those little glass bottles, not non-alcoholic. Non yeah, my favourite one is the Bundaberg. Yeah. So it's the hour rest of what well, you've got to make a little bit of adjusting. Mm. If anyone wanted the iPad, it's on. Thank you. It's really funny. 
Hey, hold it, Commodore. Um, yeah. you just went past. That went to the right, so I have to adjust this to the left. Hey, Steve, how you going? Not bad. Mark. Let me get your arrow, arrow out. Thanks, mate. Thank you. 
Okay, we definitely need to look for your arrows. <laughs> yeah, they heard that in town, Michael. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
course. Probably not, but it'd be interesting to see if it's actually 10 metres. I imagine I measured it out in my. Mountain Isaac's arrows. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> Found all Isaac's arrows. One went further than the other two. <laughs> About 65 metres. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, please. No, I just oh, oh, made you. I didn't think it was that no, it was powerful. We're going through a car. Yeah. Found all Isaac's arrows. What, uh, two of them was in the 50 meter. The other one was in the 65. <laughs> That's you're straight on. on. You're, you're, you're straight on, not over to the right and point to Mother Nature like Jim does. <laughs> <laughs> like who? You. <laughs> Just concentrate. Oh, that, that, that's, that's in the red. That's absolutely perfect. A little bit high, relax your muscles. Uh, yeah. Uh, just, just relax your arm, relax your straight arm, and relax your shoulders. <laughs> no. Jesus. <laughs> now, now, Jim, don't give him any ideas. <laughs> That's a bit high. Mate, I'm sliding it in. Hmm. And just wait for Jim to stop shooting now. Yeah, now that I've got a groove, then I can adjust it accordingly. Yeah. The one on the seven, that was a perfect shot. We can um, we can get the, uh, the bow measure up, see what we're pulling. Yeah. Yeah, the cage is open. Yeah, we can do that. Now, uh, after we get your arrows. I can get them. If you want to grab the thing. Yeah. I'll get the arrows and dig. Gentle tide, mate. Gentle tide, yeah. 
the machine I was talking, you know, talking about. Oh, I'm not 
we're pretty close, right? Eh? Oh, it's right. Um, Yeah, I was right, 54 um, draw length. Far out. Hey, that's a beautiful shot. No, you don't rub a hill on yourself. So, 54 pounds on my string. <laughs> That's why the arrow went through. <laughs> Yours is more strong than mine. Go um, 70. Try that 70 pounds on the freaking string. No. <laughs> I wouldn't. Should just try it. Yeah, 70. When I had it on full 60 when I first got it on my birthday, I could not pull it. <laughs> I could not pull it back. I got my groupie, mate. Mm. Not a bad group. No, it's too high, so I've got three of them inside my the chair. Ours? I'm going to keep it at 54 on mine. I'm going to I'm going to leave it on 54 pounds on the string. <laughs> and on the draw leg. I think that's more strong than what I can do. If I put it on full 60, I'm going to tear my shoulders to pieces. <laughs> Just, 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 just
just take a little bit to see how it goes. What's it called? What's it called? Ben Benzo. Ben Benzo. Ben Benzo. Check the targets. Yeah, targets just the cancer cells. Where it gets to be bowel cancer, brain cancer. Lung. Now how much was your dad taking, do you know? Not sure how many meals a day. Yeah. I just heard it was a drop in a glass of water. Like, you know, yeah, how big is a think, glass of water? Yeah, and yeah medicine cup, but only a couple of, maybe a meal or something. Not much. Yeah, you, you buy, you know, you buy those little cups with the divided compartments on top, little plastic things, and then you measure it up like that. Yeah. And it's cheap too. Cheap? Mm. What's the cheap, cheap the warmer. Yeah, I'll see you all later. See Good luck with the coin. See you, Jim. Sheep de wormer. Yeah. Okay, it's not good. Come on, put that feed in. Enjoying the new sauce. Yeah, put the inject on. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. My wife. In the gun. Yeah, that's it. In the right shot. That's it. Dropping that or two leaves, eh? Mmm. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Yeah. It's quite um, really calm, so just yeah. try it. Amazing how yeah. 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 it's taken off. Um, but uh, it's discouraged online. Like people put up videos, Facebook takes it down. Facebook and YouTube, they're like people taking it. Yeah. 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 Well, you can see it's up for a couple of hours and then it can take it down. Yeah, what's up to that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They'd rather have people. That would be my first place. That would be my dream. Yes. I don't know whether it's really sound, but I see exactly right. They reckon that people have come up with cures for cancer decades, decades ago. Yeah, because there's no money in it. Now we're going to run the whole thing. 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 We're Oh yeah, that'd be nice. So that's what he ended up doing. Taking that tablet rather than started taking off the liquid. Yeah, yeah. Now it's just tablet. I think he still takes it. Just get on top of it. What what range did you want to shoot? Yeah, like that. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, this is that for we'll give this a try. That's awesome. Hello? Have a shot, mate? Yeah. I've got to be a whisk at this thing. I've got to get a side of you. Yeah, good, eh? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Mine's green on that. Yeah. It came from the It goes with the Yeah. 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 Oh, so it's up and everything Yeah. I've gone this way, this way, up and down, this way. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's it, huh? Yeah. So we'll put it back in the bag and try to get away, huh? Yep. I'm going under uh, the next week for Australia. I've got to find it all the time. Yeah. What out where? Um, up at Geelong, I think. Yeah. Okay.
that's the bit short one. Yeah. This old bloke came out of nowhere. He was like, this is a Casanova fly zone, mate. 
Like an employee. That's not right. This is. And you have a good day. Don't worry. Is that five man? Yeah, it wasn't. But he lived right next door. Yeah. He was a bit sus. I was going to say, I didn't find the weed crop, mate. Don't you worry about it. People get pretty antsy about drones. Well, you guys are pretty quiet, eh? Well, it's... Oh, above sort of 150 metres it gets a bit quiet, but it sounds like a bloody hornet. But it's got people like... Yeah. It's good for camping with no one around. Yeah, that's probably it. There'd be a couple of pervs out there though, I think. Imagine taking it to a nudist beach or something. for those uh finish up. As soon as they go to the back of them and that's it. So who's my kid? Mm. Oh. Those guys. Oh. As soon as they do the front line inside. They have to get off. Yeah. After they finish. That's a weekend.
holding before you even raw, like holding your breath before you even raw, because otherwise you're getting fatigued. Yeah.
Adjusting the bow again. Yeah, this is up as far as it can go. Mm. Mm. Pull out and have to adjust that to sight. Thank you. 
As I did. Uh, for the week, I might buy you one of those. So it clings oh, down. It yeah, clings down it's here. Too much weight, mate. I think I'll just use this. To be honest with you. It clings down there, so you can see on the ground. Yeah, it's a good idea. But I'll just use the rest of it. Yeah. Yep. Yeah.
Well, ladies and gents, I got to um, go. I got my car started. Got to call my dad what, what he needs. not picking up uh, oh well so right now I gotta go home ladies and gents um, hopefully it's not a problem so right now I'll see you guys back at the Dragon's Den till then I gotta get some oil for my car so oh I can get that after lunch so I'll see you guys later well Early call, early going home. Oh well. So right now, I had a really good time at archery. And for a couple of hours, that's not bad. So, yeah, okay. Okay. Stumpy, I will show you down a stinky. Now, well, um, let me set up the I gotta clean this up anyway. So today I done absolutely good on the compound. Even the um, longbow shooting, what you guys saw earlier, that was absolutely awesome what my friend Ian taught me. Um, absolutely awesome shots. Nearly got the balloon, so that's another thing. But Somehow my arrows keep going over the target because I point to a little bit high, but yeah, I tried and I tried and I tried. I'm not gonna give up. Longbow shots, fucking beautiful. So right now I gotta get this tripod up and up so I can actually clean this doodle up. So yeah. So right now, um, yeah, today was absolutely freaking perfect. Even, I have not seen my friend Heath today. He said that he will come to Saturday and Sunday, but you know, I haven't seen him yesterday or today, so, yeah, it's very weird. He got a friend. So it was really busy. I think he lives in the city anyway. So right now, um, I gotta clean this up anyway. So let me see you guys back here. I gotta clean this doo doo up. Uh, it's a fresh one too. I can smell it. Yeah, it's not done long, so it's only a couple minutes old. So yeah, I actually had a really good day. And I did not stay that long. It, no, I was planning to stay about 11, 11 30, but no. Uh, uh, family calls, but I don't mind. Right, yeah, that's cleaned up. Spread the mulch around. There we go. So, yeah, I have to do stuff today, but yeah. So after lunch, I gotta go to 
um, Bathurst Oliver bun to get 10W50 for my car. Um, pen right. So that's what I'm going to do. Something that I need to do for my car is make my car run better. So that's what I'm going to do. So right now I'm going to I don't know, I have some lunch and just uh, go to the Bathurst Oliban, come back and get some fuel for tomorrow. Um, there was not that much there. Uh, there was not that much people there today. It was absolutely another quiet one. So, 12 o'clock yesterday, um, the learners class started. And me and my friend Martin actually set up everything um, for the morning and we thought it was a morning class but when 12 o'clock hits everyone came so the new president of the archery club that is my friend Kelly she said it's a 12 o'clock start class so me and Martin actually set everything up for no reason so <laughs> we was dog tired after all that so yeah so after lunch go to Bathurst Oliban to get 10W30 or 10W50 I mean um, for my car so I can do an oil change um, the 5W30 is to the light for my car the oil is not staying up it's on the bottom of the oil dipstick that is that much so yeah so right now my boys are happy as they can be so after lunch go to the Baffers oil barn get the oil come back here feed the bit of dragons it's gonna be a tiring day anyway. But I done my longbow shots. It is absolutely freaking awesome. Um, the longbow shots is the impossible shots to get to the right angle, to get the right measure of wind, where the wind's blowing, and if it's blowing straight ahead, the arrow's going to the right direction. But if it blows the wrong way, the arrow's going like straight. The opposite direction so yeah so next Sunday I'm gonna learn from my friend Ian again so after lunch let's go to the oil barn get oil then come back here so I'll see you guys then all right I just got out of the store brought 10w50 and right now that's the oil I need to use for my car. So right now, let's start up this car. I gotta do a full oil change wherever the jacks are come back. Sorry I did not film because I had people around me, so yeah. So right now, let's go home and feed the dragon. Sorry I did not film straight away, so I'll see you guys back there. Okay. In the chair. Uh, whew. Whew. Oh, yeah. I am back in the drain vent. So, right now, I'm bugged. But I had a lot of fun, but Tomorrow I'll get the balloons tomorrow morning and then go to the archery. Yeah. It is right now. What a busy day. Well, what a fun day. But the thing is, it was really quiet today. Not that much people of that archery. So. Yeah, 
the thing is, um, archery is a really good sport. Even so, it's gonna be absolutely great. So, right now, let's feed these two boys. Got the feed bowl here. Gonna move the mouse out of the way so I don't get it dirty. Um, oh, drop down, you stupid power raid. Oh well, I gotta feed these two before the end of the day is ended. So, right now. Wizards. Oh, so these two are hungry. Every every time when I come in here with food, they they're always hungry. So right now, oh, there's two worms straight up. Free. Okay, that's free. Four. Five. Now they're going crazy. <laughs> That's number six. You still are crazy. <laughs> These. <laughs> this happened every freaking time. I gotta leave the. Air conditioner point in that way so it doesn't blow the sawdust on the floor. Alright, two, four, six, seven, eight. Come on, fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Thirteen. Eighteen. Nine. He's <laughs> tappy. <laughs> you can actually see his tail now. It's bulge on the sides. Sorry, I point out the tail, baby boy. I think that's all the worms. Oh, wait. Train. I'll sift all those out later and see how many ones are there because I don't know if there's any more in this. My friend Shane on the other words, he's not coming back to archery because his wife's not well, that's understandable. Um, so yeah, um, if it goes like this I'll be volunteering as a secretary coach. I'll be volunteering on that. Hey! Stumpy, get off show his head. He's getting squashed by your friggin' big feet. <laughs> Silly friggin' big boy. Okay. Plus I got a cold coffee next to me so I can have a cold drink. Oh Sherry, you okay baby boy? Are you okay? Oh, come here, good boy. There we go. Hey, you're shaking beautifully. Hey now, hey now. Yeah, he wants the ones as well. That's one. Two. 
two, three, four, five. What the fuck? Hey, give me you little bitch. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Fourteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Thirteen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Queen. Wiggly little shit. Okay, um, the thing is, I need to sift these ones out too, so they'll be coming up as well with these ones. That is really good because I don't want them to get hungry. Hey, hey, hey. There they go. They're feeding. <laughs> so let me grab you guys. Need to get up and close. So, yeah, this is gonna be absolutely great. They got a great feeding diet. And that is absolutely good because they are feeding quite good now. What's this twist? There you go, big boy. So yeah, these two are doing fine. Even though I like to play with them, anyway. These are my big boys. Neil, Neil. Spit out. Oh my god. <laughs> Get the sticks out of his mouth. He's he found a mealworm on the mulch. Trying to clean his mouth from debris. Yeah. Plus, he's shedding on the chin and on top of the head, so he's in shed right now. Stumpy's already shed. That is actually good. Put those back. So yeah, Stumpy's already shedded, and he's a beautiful gold color. Chevy, he's getting the old skin off his beard, off the top of his head and on the back legs and the tail so he's going to be shedding soon so that is absolutely good hey hey it's okay dad don't try to help it's okay good boy come on here's Sampy 
<laughs> Happy boy, come on. Abdi. Abdi, come on. Such a happy, happy boy. He's always been happy. I love my, I love my beard dragons. They always be the happiest reptiles I love. Is these two. So, yeah, that is pretty good. So right now the time is eight minutes past two and a half, and then so fourteen oh eight. So, yeah, it's been really good. Uh, I've been having quiet days, and it's a bit weird because my friends always bother uh, my friends always bother me on the group chat. So, no, I don't know what's happening. So right now, um. I don't know, we can turn them off in the afternoon now. So, right now, I'll see you guys about 4 o'clock till then. Let's put these to bed and then end it from there anyway. So, I'll see you guys at 4 o'clock. Uh, well, ladies and gents, I had a wonderful day. I'm drinking bush LT. And this is my second cup for the week. I had one yesterday afternoon. Now I'm having this one for today's afternoon, so far out. I'm drinking tea in the afternoon. Well I can't drink tea I can't drink coffee in the afternoon or I won't sleep. And that's the problem. <laughs> if I drink coffee right now, I won't go to sleep till about ten o'clock at night. So right now it's two minutes past four in the afternoon. So right now let's take our let's take my hat off. I had a long day today. So right now let's turn off the oh. <laughs> used to sleeping cross. <laughs> I'm my boys. I love you too. Hey, me you too, Chevy. You always be the goodest boy. Come on. Come on, Sammy. Good boy. Good boy. Come on, Chev. It's late time. Come on, Chev. It's late time. Oh, so I had a wonderful day today. So wonderful. And yeah, it's been really good, but yeah, I didn't even get any balloons today. I got the ten and the nine, but no balloons. All my friends beat me to the, to them. Even my friend Logan, far out, one sharp shooter with a compound that is more bigger than mine. He, he's a sixty pound compound, but more bigger. Plus my friend Dave's selling his compound bow because he's given up on archery. Man, everyone's given up on archery today. Oh, well, I'm not going to give up on it. Archery is my favorite thing to do. And I'm just getting the TV ready to relax. I am really tired today. Uh, after the good shootout today at archery, like good target practice, and then hanging around with friends that you know for that many years, it's actually great. It is absolutely beautiful. So right now, I might go turn on the TV, watch something while I drink my bushel tea. And that's called bullshit, not green tea. I don't drink green tea, I don't drink plant. <laughs> that's the thing. So right now, let's watch, I'm gonna watch YouTube and relax. I had a really good shit out. If I show you guys my um, longbow skills, what my friend Ian 
taught me today it, it actually came out really good I didn't even lose any arrows today that's the most important bit I did not even lose any arrows so that's one thing that I did not do today is losing arrows I did not lose any of them I'm still I still lost one from last Sunday and I'm still looking for it even me, me and my friend Ian was walking through the bush to look for it and look for my arrow and he's too turkey fell arrows for his longbow it was no bit of, no way to be found it was absolutely fucking weird the arrows just like gone just vanished we checked underneath the grass nowhere we checked in the bush no way to be found so where the hell are they that's the question that is the mystery question of right now and the degrees outside is about 28 man that's a pretty warm freaking weather man so right now I'll see you guys tomorrow morning at archery I'm gonna go to archery early then do something else I gotta I got have breakfast first, then go to the archery in the morning, then come back here, help my whole family to do different things. And, you know, help family is important. Helping a whole lot of family. So, right now, I am done for today. I'm tired. I'm exhausted. Yeah, from. All the shooting, perfect. And today's only the 21st, so yeah. But today's been absolutely fucking perfect. I love it. So, yeah. So, right now, let's turn off these two, let them sleep, and let them relax. So, I'll see you guys next time. Till then, I'll see you guys tomorrow at Archery. Till then, let's do some more practice shots to get back, back at, at to it. Because I kind of lost all my skill today. Shooting all the balloons, I lost all my skill. Somehow. <laughs> so, I'll see you guys next time. Till then, get over here!